Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I decided to do a DIY on this uh, shelf. Um, I really don't like it, so I'm gonna be redecorating it. So first we're gonna need to move my little birdie mango. Um, if you want, I can do a video on him. I've been deciding to do like some uh, taking care of him video or something like that. And then uh, I'm just going to remove my handbags and this blanket. So I've just cleared the chest of drawers with the blanket and the handbags as you can see. And these are just little bumps that I'm going to remove. Uh, I have printed out a couple of photos of the 60s because that's what I want my like pattern and designs to be based off. Um, and you can just do that on a computer. You don't need any fancy thing. And you just want to cut around the borders, as you can see. Um, you don't want any white lines. I'm just using a bit of foam glue or PVA glue. It's like the same thing. I'm going to mix it with a little bit of paint. And um, I am also will use uh, some water just to make it thin. So here is the water that I'm using. I only need a little bit as if the thinner you make it, the more product you're going to get out of it. And then some paint. I'm just going to paint a square about roughly the size of the picture that I will be sticking down. And here is the first one that I'm placing down. So this is what I've done so far. I've done all of the uh, drawers, but I'm going to paint the bottom around the sides there and there. So yeah, I am really sick of it. <laughs> uh, so as the sides have patterns on it, I'm going to paint the patterns and let them dry before I paint the rest of it as it will look better and you won't see dark splotches. And also on the other side, I finished it as well. So, yeah, that's what I've done so far. So, I'm just adding a bit of tea bag um, to make this look a bit older. I think it looks nice. Um, I realised though that putting the tea on the actual photos makes the ink ink leak as you can see like here but it looks pretty cool so yeah i really suggest doing this if you want to have like an older sort of vintage look um so yeah and here is the final product i'm so happy with it it looks really good um i just added uh, things like some a pair of vintage shoes and a guitar and some handbags and i really like it. it looks really good and just remember you can add whatever type of photos you like to it i just like this vintage look um so yeah i was really pleased with how this turned out and as you see the sides are painted and yeah it looks really nice Thanks for watching guys, I hope you do this if you have any old or you know like manky cupboards and yeah thanks for watching, I know this video is quite different but I really enjoyed making it, bye!